Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Rosa. I live on San Miguel Island. And on this channel, I love to share a little bit of my journey with you guys and what it's like living on a small island. Here in the Azores on San Miguel Island, um, in Portugal in general, people do not decorate for fall. It is not a tradition. It is not something people celebrate. Um, unfortunately, because fall is beautiful. Although I was raised in Canada, I lived there for the first half of my life. So fall is actually something pretty big to me. I love fall. It's such a beautiful season. If you've ever been to Canada, you know what I'm talking about. The beautiful colored leaves falling from the trees. Fall is beautiful, especially in Canada. And so when this time of year comes around, I get so nostalgic and I miss it so much. So I try to bring fall into my home. And this is what I'm doing in this video today. I am decorating a little bit of my home. I have most of my decor out and I wanted to share it with you guys. So what I am doing is I'm decorating my front hall first off. And I am just adding in a mix of pieces that I bought, a mix of pieces that I created myself, and some real pumpkins slash gourds, whatever you want to call them. And I hope this gives you some decorating ideas. Even if you live in a country that doesn't sell fall decor, you can make some fall decor yourself. I have a video already up on my channel of some DIY fall decor and I'm planning to release one more. So if you're not already subscribed, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss that. When it comes to my fall decor collection, I don't really have much and you, if you want to see what I do have, all of my fall decor, I did actually film a video on that. I'll link it in the description box below if you're curious to see that. But when I compare all of my fall decor to other people here on social media, I have close to nothing. And obviously I wish I had more, but this year I was lucky enough to get gifted by a neighbor some small little pumpkins or gourds um, that actually are doing a really good job in filling my fall decor for this year and so i have been using them all over my house um, they are not rotting they are because a pumpkin actually lasts a very very long time if you don't know and so i've had some of these pumpkins since uh, the beginning of august all of them were picked in August and they are still um, very intact and so I hope they will last out throughout Halloween even maybe um, November I already start decorating for Christmas so um, but here in the Azores they don't sell father core and online there isn't much to choose from most of the stuff they sell online, like on Amazon or on Chain, um, is all Halloween stuff, not fall. And I'm not ready to decorate for Halloween yet. I think I'm going to wait for October to start Halloween. And I just want to appreciate the beauty of fall. So I am finishing this little entrance table that I have here at the front part of my house. And I'm not sure if it's a little over the top or too full, but when it comes to decorating for the festive seasons, I am going to go over the top. I don't know about you guys, but I am not minimalist at all when it comes to decor, fall decor, Christmas decor. You guys, I will be decking this house out. <laughs> so as I finish decorating this table here I am going to take out some little wax melts and I am going to turn on a little tea light candle so that it will melt my wax and make my house or at least my hall smell like fall and this is one of my favorite parts of decorating it's the smells I love I love a candle you guys I love candles how about you
we move into the living room right after I finish this table and my living room the layout of my living room I don't have much furniture I can actually put fall decor on so I just decorate my coffee table and my couch and um, that's the vibe in here I have nowhere else to put some fall decor in this living room but that's okay we work with what we have and so I will be decorating this little coffee table that I have and I decided to use like a little tea a towel to add in a little bit of color then I added my gold tray that's always in here year round and I'm using this little ceramic a pumpkin that I bought in Burlington's last year uh, from TJ Maxx that is scented it smells so so good and then I have my little uh, you know cups holders uh, so that it protects my table because if you probably don't know this I don't think anyone knows this I don't think I've ever talked about this on my channel but this little coffee table was my mine and Louise's first um, purchase together of furniture so this coffee table has a lot of meaning to me and I hope that it lasts many many years because it's very special to me Anyways, in order to decorate the sofa, uh, I just added in some throw blankets and some fall themed pillows and that was that. So the final area that I'm going to show you me decorating in this video is in my kitchen. It's actually where I usually have my cat food. Um, in this cabinet, I usually actually put away all my dishes, but on top, uh, there's always putting scissors cat food there and cat bowls, but those are going to be moved on to a different place until the next year because this year will always be decorated until the end of the year. I started with an orange tea towel and then I layered some wood pieces in the background. So I have a wooden cut-in board and that wooden sign that I painted and then I'm going to add in different pieces with like a wooden crate with pumpkins to fill inside. Um, I'm adding a battery powered leaf garland which makes it look very mystical, very pretty. I love the glowing. Um, it makes it very cozy. The lights are very comforting. Alright, so this is it for this video. I have decorated these three little areas of my house and it is feeling so cozy already let me know have you started decorating for fall already i was thinking about this in august but i held on until september this is when i filmed this video september 1st i couldn't hold on anymore anyways i want to thank you guys so so much for watching don't forget to like this video if this is the type of video that you like to watch uh, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss future content and hit that notification bell so that you are notified when i upload a video and I hope to see you guys next time. Bye!